My brothers, I'd like to show you something over here in Flagstaff, Arizona about copper freeze brakes, which we often get over here. This is a hose bib that's frost proof, but sure enough, they left the hose connected full of water and it totally froze and split the pipe. The first time the split occurred right here, I scrubbed it up. I tapped it shut and I brazed over it with silver phosphorus brace, leaving a slight buildup as a repair method, alternative to replacing lots of sections of pipes and joints and things. Um, and this second time this occurred, the repair proved strong and sturdy. Lo and behold, though, it's still, of course, broke. Can't have it. Um, freezing they have to disconnect that hose and it can't leave water in this thing but it's split over here the second time i also like to demonstrate this heat trap this is um, the klingon heat trap it's a piece of sheet metal with its um, edges feathered in with it we can it holds the heat in and we can scoot our torch all the way around the joint. Uh, just spin that trap as we travel along. And with a map torch, with a, a pencil tip, we can get that pipe hot enough to braze without the complexity of the oxygen acetylene torch, even though the oxygen acetylene torch is so much hotter, handier, nicer. Of course, cannot be any heat sinks around like a compressor full of oil close by. Um, out, gotta be out of the wind. No airflow up and down through the pipe, so the end should be lightly capped off. Um, and it's helpful to have the pipe possibly in the horizontal. There we go. God bless you.